right, start of a new session. Um, there's an elephant in the room that I want to address, and it's actually kind of weird that I haven't addressed this before. But, uh, I mean, this is, I guess it's time to address it because I don't know how far into the game I am. Comparatively, I don't know how close I am to the end. But we have a little, we, how do I even say this? So most people know that, like, everybody loves, everybody was okay with Mass Effect 1. Everybody loves Mass Effect 2. Mass Effect 3, on the other hand, I, I legitimately don't remember if I've talked about this, but Mass Effect 3 has a bit of a reputation for being, like, the game that angered fans by the ending. And I will say it now, I have not... I, I had, like, one thing about this game spoiled to me, and that was because I did it to myself. That was, like, last recording session, too, where it was, like, Sergeant. the possibility that Miranda could die. And I don't 100% know if I'm doing that correctly. I'm just going about the game as if I didn't know that. And I don't 100% know. I think I, the only thing I saw was, like, you had to have read the dossier on Kai Ling for uh, Shepard to have given her a warning and I had already done, I had already looked at the uh, Lang, the Kai Lang's uh, dossier so I was already on the right track to keeping Miranda alive uh, without knowing it so I'm letting that one play out the way it is like even if, uh, I don't know if I knew, if I didn't know what I have like, if I hadn't done it, and then... Uh, what was I... Oh, wait, right. I need to talk about Mass Effect. This game, supposedly, the ending just angered so many people. I have not had the ending of this game spoiled to me. I don't know what it's going to be. I just know that a lot of people were disappointed by this ending. So yeah, I mean, that was just something I needed to say because I haven't said it yet. Um, I'm kind of fully aware that the ending of this game might be disappointing to me. So far, I'm not... I don't know. I don't... See, here's the thing. I have said this before, too. I, or at least I think I've, said, I've gone on recordings having said it, but uh, when it comes to like what I call the three the three big Bioware games being Knights of the Old Republic, Dragon Age, and Mass Effect. I think Dragon Age might be my favorite with Knights of the Old Republic if if not tied then at a very close second. So Mass Effect is my third favorite and I have a few reasons for that. I do enjoy it, but this one I feel like I'm not as immersed in as Dragon Age and I mean Knights of the Old Republic it was Star Wars but it was also a great game so there's just a lot going for that. Remind me to fire Trainer. She's the worst. I really do wonder how far into this I am and when I'm gonna start getting to the ending. I feel like the way my companions have started talking to me about like wouldn't it be great if this and it's like well I've always wanted to do this so let's do it now kind of feel like that's making me feel like it's coming to a close now, but story-wise, I feel like we're not there yet. So I'm getting conflicting messages from my companions. You're sure of what you saw? But I was saying too, it's like I'm, I feel like I'm less immersed in this world, and overall it's like Dragon Age where it was uh, like all the characters I cared about, and Knights of the Old Republic, there were all these characters I cared about, and then this one's kind of like, this guy's cool. Like, there hasn't really been any character in this franchise yet that I've been like super, super, super interested in. I mean, like, I like Garrus, he's always there, and I like Caden. I like, uh, I liked Miranda, and I liked, uh, oh, Tally, right. I like Tally, all right, even though I don't really use her that much. And I'm actually kind of okay with um, Liera, too. Might as well go save the Admiral and shut down the Geth. Sing him a babber. Also, I'm eating Skittles now, just to continue on that 
trend of me eating everything while I'm recording. Hmm, do we save the Admiral first or do we shut down the guest server? Will shutting down the guest server make it easier to save the Admiral? Shoot, I didn't do tally. I always forget the third person when I level up. Like, I did that in Dragon Age a lot too, where I'd level like two people and then like forget the third and fourth. Third person was usually Vivienne. Or she was usually fourth, actually, now that I think about it. Understood, Admiral Ron. We're almost at the server. Keep us posted. What's our status? We remain undetected on encrypted geth channels. Resistance is likely only within the server. Within? It's that big? You misunderstand. Direct virtual interface is necessary to extract geth from the server. You must enter our consensus. You want me to virtually interact with the geth? That kind of tech isn't even on the market. This can't be safe. I'm not a machine. How do I go into a virtual world? Servers conducted research on Geth human interfaces. They called it Project Overlord. We monitored their transmissions. We have refined the interface they created and have equipment from Normandy to facilitate safe contact. We request your trust. I have your back, Legion. Even if I don't quite understand why you need it. You are an unknown. This is an advantage. Geth security is not adept at targeting organic thought processes. While we occupy the system's intrusion countermeasures, you will disable the squadrons by removing Geth from the server. If it saves the live ships, we've got to try it. Telemetry data predicts this operation has a high chance of success. There is little time. We will bypass security while you secure safe landing. Wait, you're not gonna... Let's set the shuttle down by the cliff. Okay, then. Is he wearing a parachute? No. No, he wasn't. This is it? Yes. Hostile Geth fighter squadrons are networked to this server. Due to restricted resources, it is best if you connect alone. Let's do it. Initiating peer network integration. Proceed to docking port. This is like the memory hub things from Fallout 4. Consensus remains still. Shepard Commander, access movement during an upload is discouraged. Commander, we acknowledge your integration into the server. We welcome you to our consensus. What am I doing? What is this? We have installed filters to allow you to make visual sense of the server's raw data. Your mind perceives our world as something familiar. I wouldn't call this familiar. Where are you? Here. 
You look different. We have made ourselves visually distinct for your convenience. What about Geth already in here? You will perceive Geth as surveillance footage, audio logs, sensor records. We do not require bodies, as our software communes. Our hardware is merely a tool. This is our true world. As we remove Geth, it will grow dark. And what does turning off the lights do to the Geth back in the real world? The Geth fighter squadrons communicate with platforms on their spacecraft via this server. We will sever that connection. We will ensure there are no transfers or backups. This server will fall silent. This is like wiping out a city, isn't it? We have no choice in this matter. It is a question of survival. There are two communication nodes on this server. We must access them to disable the hostile Geth spiders. We must protect your exit port, but you will not be alone. We will maintain contact and assist. Okay, this is getting weird. Establishing connection to access point. What gun do I have? Wait. Oh, this is the only gun that I have. Warning, connection blocked by infected code. Use our combat software to disrupt the infection. I wondered what the gun was for. This foreign code is a manifestation of the old machine signal. You're surprised the Reapers are all over your servers? We did not anticipate such extensive infection. Oh, I just hadn't cleared enough of it. Okay. Okay, I gotta ask. Why a gun? We wish to provide familiar equipment. Huh. Okay, the... Thanks. I think. And the developers didn't want to move away from the already established GUI. No, at least I didn't want to go too far. Did I just go in a circle? Okay, there we go. Connection established. Proceed to the access point. This is weird. This is weird. Establishing connection to communication node. Error. Access denied. Is the Reaper keeping you out? Unknown. Please investigate. So I can still do my loop de loops. Data cluster contains infected code. We require access to proceed. Anyway. until we gain access to this data cluster. Oh, I forget. I keep forgetting I can sprint.
accessing data cluster. What is this? Data clusters contain historical data. Your connection permits streaming of information from our archives. You really want to rename the VI networks? Absolutely. The mobile hardware release deserves a little ceremony. Unit zero 01. What is the Keelish word for servant of the people? The word is Gath, creator Zahak. Yes. Very good. Ancestor, you fuss over it. Weren't you here until midnight fixing zero one circuitry? Well, it needed resoldering. Wasn't that footage from the past? Why are the Corians masked? You process our memories by using your own. How many creators have you witnessed unmasked? Good point. Okay, good. It did start. Making myself a path. You must disrupt the infection on this data cluster to continue. Okay, so we got that. So if so, this is the inside of a guest's mind. Then I'm assuming this is what the collective, as they call it. This data cluster contains information timestamped 290 years ago. It is still capable of serving. You see, it's ignoring all shutdown commands. Please specify if it has failed assigned tasks. We will reprogram. Well, let's take a look. Creator, this unit is ready to serve. What has it done wrong? What? Let's cut the audio. You may proceed to the last data cluster. The last one? Accessing data cluster. We've got escaped guests. They're pins. Open fire. Hmm. One going for a weapon. So who won? The platform arming itself was an agricultural unit. By opening fire on attacking creators, it saved simpler domestic gap following it. That looks a lot like the sniper rifle you used to carry. It is an efficient model. Establishing connection with the remote oh, so Is Legion the original guess? <clears throat> Hello, Commander. Are you there? Shepherds working on shutting down the server, Admiral Ron. I can fill you in. The guest squadrons have arrived, but something is amiss. Half their fighters have stopped functioning. We will continue to hold out as long as we can. So it's working. Uh, pursuing the guest's history would. Reviewing the guest history would. Like, go Phantom Menace on the whole operation. The Reaper code has adapted. It can now self-replicate. You mean it grows back? Yes. 
However, disrupting vulnerable points in the infection may slow down its replication. Shepard Commander, target the vulnerable points of the infection to slow its replication speed. You must search for a vulnerable point in the infection. Disrupting it will slow the infection's ability to replicate. I don't know what I'm doing. There is a vulnerable point further along the infection. Target this spot to slow its growth toward the data cluster. What did he even just say? There is a vulnerable point on the infection leading to the data cluster. Disrupt the infection at this spot. It will slow regrowth long enough to access the data cluster. Oh, there we go. That was weird. So I wasn't even targeting the one in front of me. I was supposed to target the one above me. Could have told me that. <laughs> 